loved it he loved when we would like throw a snowball to him but he'd get confused and try to like get the snowball but then you know it'd fall apart and so he was like wah, 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 i didn't know. know what to do oh it's so God. adorable so adorable so we totally had snowball fights we yes. tried to build the snowball but there wasn't quite an, or snowman yeah yeah, yeah. But there wasn't quite enough snow sure, sure, sure. but we had so much fun in the snow yeah. um before that we went hiking it was really Ooh. fun watched a lot of movies of course um uh, did you watch Encanto? Oh my god, I have to watch it. I'm actually planning to watch it tonight. It's the greatest movie. Some really great songs in there. We're going to have to sing some songs yes. when you see it. Um, but yeah, that was it. Spent a lot of time with family and friends. Yes. It was just a great break. That's so good. I also had a great time. Didn't do too many things. Right. Just like celebrated with family. Right. It was wonderful. And oh. of course, like the new year was great. And new just, oh. year. I can't believe it. Another year. No, 2022. Oh, I hope it's a great year. I'm feeling so old. No, you're not old. Oh. You're what, like 18, 19? I'm 50. No way. I'm 50 this year. Shush. Just kidding. Speaking what? of age. Yes. New new year. New month. New birthdays. birthdays. Let's, Let's do out. it. Let's do it. Birthdays, gotta love it. Oh, okay. Speaking of birthdays, birthdays. Okay, so this past Sunday this was past January Sunday? 9th. January 9th. Such a special day it's for a great day. many people. So many birthdays. Yeah, so many birthdays. But a special birthday on January 9th. A super special birthday. Beatrice Mar Kennedy's yes. birthday on January 9th, this yes. past Sunday. Yes, and in case you don't know who that is, which you should. Uh, yeah. That's who our school is named after. Exactly. She would have been something like 130. 132. 32. Wow. Yes. And I mean, she was such an amazing woman. She was like the first African American to graduate from law school in Oregon. Wow. And she right? was the editor of The Advocate. Right. Oh Which my is gosh. Who we are. We're the advocates, we right? We are the advocates. We know are. It. I mean, so she did that. I mean, did you hear that they actually recently did a mural of her in Portland? I had no idea. Oh my gosh. I have a video about it. Do you want to see? I would love to see okay, it. Okay, let's do it. Let's, let's do, it. do it. My name is Mauricio Ramirez, and I'm a visual artist. I specialize in both public art and murals. And today I'm at the Shrunk Riverview Tower located right here in the St. John's neighborhood of Portland, Oregon. I draw inspiration from different places. And today I'm drawing inspiration from the natural landscape around me. The Douglas Firs, the Willamette River. And not only that, the history that existed here before me. Beatrice Murrow Kennedy because of her great legacy that she left on. She was the first African-American woman to practice law in the state of Oregon. And not only that, she used her entire platform to break down the barriers of race, color, and class prejudice as an editorial writer of the Advocate.
I love that elapsed time, how they show it so fast. Yes. I'm sure that took like months to create. Uh, yeah, and planning. Right. Not just the actual painting, but the planning. Uh, oh, 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 Kennedy News Interruption. Oh, Kennedy News Interruption. Oh my goodness. Uh, all this talk about Beatrice's art and stuff totally reminded me that I forgot to tell you about some other art. So wait a minute. Watch this quick video. Hi, Kennedy kids. I cannot believe I am at the district office. Where's the district office, you say? Well, it's in Milwaukee. That's where all of the super important people are that help to make sure our school district runs nice and smooth. Well, our school was chosen to have our artwork, your artwork, displayed here at the district office. It's amazing. So let's take a quick tour inside and see where all your artwork has been displayed. Come on, let's go. back to Encanto. And don't forget, we don't talk about Bruno. Bruno. <laughs> wow, that artist was amazing. So oh, good. Makes so my good. heart all warm and fuzzy inside. Mine too. Oh, 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 oh. oh. hello. Hello, heart. Hello. My heart's speaking. What's it saying? You hear my heart? Yes. My heart is saying, uh -huh. <gasps> what? Jump rope for heart. What? Jump rope for heart. Oh. What? What is jump rope for heart? Oh, that's such a great question. I mean, I know it has something to do with friends that have special hearts. Is it when your heart does jump ropes? Because I feel like that would hurt. <laughs> You're so silly. Well, oh, but I, oh, it's jump rope. Oh my goodness. Well, you know what? I just happen to know we have two friends okay. who could probably tell us a little bit about it. Okay, that's good. Uh -huh. My heart and I got some questions. There you go. Well, take it away, Mr. Bateman and Miss Gores. Let's do it. Hey, Advocats, we are so excited to bring back Kids Heart Challenge this year. So after this video, sometime today, you're going to be watching an assembly that's gonna kick off the Kids Heart Challenge and tell you what it's all about, why we're doing it, how we get a chance to help kids with special hearts, and how we get to help our own heart health by staying active and healthy in PE and as well as outside of school. And starting next Monday, we're going to be jump roping and PE to kick off your heart healthy challenge. We can do it, advocates. Absolutely. You know what? I just love how we, you know, got to talk about 
all the fun we had over break. Right. And then we talked about birthdays, then we talked about Hannity. Right. And then we talked about happy heart. And that just That's makes me what? feel so good. Like my heart feels good, right. my brain feels good. It just makes you uh, so happy. I feel happy. Uh, I mean, I feel like we can end on a happy note. Exactly. Right? I think so. I think so. So too. until next time. Until next time, out the couch. Ciao. Adios.